Hey guys, Reckless Gamer here. Welcome to the final part of Sonic 06. Oh, Chaos Emeralds, Gems of Miracles, please heed my call. I wish to save this world. I wish to cleanse my father's sin, and I wish to talk to Sonic once again. You have given me so many things. Now it is my time to return the favor. I care not what happens to me, but please heed my <coughs> voice. Sonic, come back to me, to us. Oh, she's just gonna go for it. Fuck it. Sonic's back, we did it guys. Alright, it's go time. That body of light is the sign of a super-dimensional life form. Standard attacks won't work on him. He eats dimensions for lunch. But there should be something that's anchoring him in this dimension. That's probably the light shells that can be seen on his body. If all of those are destroyed, he can be defeated. Everyone, you need rings to stay in a super state, but maintaining this form consumes rings. Make sure you don't run out of rings. If you're running low, it's on you, Shadow. To switch to someone else. Understood. Okay, guys. So we're finally here. We're taking on Solaris. Um, we got Super Sonic, Shadow, and Silver. Um, you know, he's taking on this crazy angel god form. Um, it's it's all pretty interesting stuff to me. Um, let's go ahead and stop messing around. I'll take care of this. So first off, this is the end. Prepare to meet your doom. Oh yeah, that's how you know um, you have the right character to attack with um, when they speak to uh, Solaris. But yeah, anyways, um, so I was theorizing about it in uh, both Shadow and Silver story because they're the ones that go back to uh, the Solaris um, accident or whatever the hell they were calling it. Oh jeez, I'm not Good gonna luck, Sonic. Okay. Watch out, laser. Damn. It's all you, Shadow. Shadow. Understood. Yes. Um, I'm still playing the original game here, so obviously it's still gonna be a little janky. Silver, uh, he has issues when when the, oh, I can't speak when in his super state. Silver. Let's it's see if he has. Take care of Not this. really, but we'll take it. Uh, yeah, I just try to throw um, what I have. Instead of like trying to gather a bunch of um, things up, I just try to throw what I have. Uh, I think we can do a cracker shell real quick. Yep, bam. Okay, I think we might be able to do some damage with Shadow Map okay. if we want to. It's 
It's on you, Shadow. Understood. A super dimensional move. This might have to be a fair fight. Yeah, so I guess um, Solaris started off as um, uh, a god, and then I think the eagle is like a form that it can take place. And that's what this form here is supposed to like be representing. Um, like an uh, eagle, the head, and the wings on it. I thought that we could do damage with Shadow, but I don't think I can. Oh yeah, it is. Okay. And then, um, so I guess like the lore behind it. I don't know if maybe like the NPCs tell you about it or something, but um, he somehow um, ends up turning into the flame form when he's like dormant. This is him in like its god form, full power type. And then the flame is like when it's dormant, and the flame was entrusted to the royal family. Yeah, that cracked. Silver, it's your turn. Yeah, I'm still gonna do more damage with Silver. And, um, you know, the Duke's wife, Elise's mom, she dies. Come on. It's so hard to grab these things with Silver. I'm throwing it. I'm not letting go. Come on. I think that did damage. Nope. Looks Good like it's Sonic's turn. Okay. All right, it's my turn. Let's have some fun, Solaris. Yeah. So the Duke's wife dies, um, and he can't take it. Like, um, I don't know what the exact details are on how she died. I think maybe just sickness. He couldn't stop it, and so he takes the royal family's eternal flame, and he tries to. Um, control time with Solaris, but I guess Solaris itself can control time. Good luck, Sonic. Yeah, we're going for that. Oh, I was too slow. I don't know what happened there. Maybe I pressed it just a little too early. Look at him, he's looking crazy now. Watch out for the lasers. Yeah, I don't think we're going to get the S-Rank on this one, but we'll see. Because I really wanted to talk about the lore behind this guy. Okay? Use the wine, We're good. Sorry. Bam. Think Shadow. So yeah, that's when the accident happened, and then Solaris was split it into Iblis no, and Ephelis. It's not over yet. I guess it's not gonna be that easy. Nope. <laughs> that shit's crazy. Is it impossible to defeat a super close. dimensional being after all? No. Something's different. I can feel a large, powerful consciousness coming from Solaris. What? A consciousness? That's it. That's his core. Even if we can't stop his form, we can stop his consciousness. Okay, yeah, so, um, I don't know what the Duke did to it, but he did something to it, and that's what caused it to split. Um, some people theorize that maybe he was trying to awaken it and make it become, you know, Solaris, because it was in the flame state, um, and that's what split it, and then basically, yeah. It's all cool stuff. I kind of like what they were going for. This would have been a cool little um, alternate universe kind of deal. I still think that they should make a, a sequel to this game. I know everybody would be like, what the fuck, why would they do that? But I think that would be crazy. Like, let this be its own universe. Let it have its own um, separate, similar lore. You know what I mean? But it's all it's all too late for that. But that, it, it could have been cool. I could have seen how they could have carried it through the Switch. It's not Also, of course, the music goes crazy. 
Um, I actually really do like the no those lasers. Do it. Do it. Hey, do you have switch? Oh, I love all these lines. It's all epic with this music. Damn. Nope, nothing yet. Thanks, Silver. Oh, he's kicking my ass, I'd say. I was trying to be quiet there for the music, and then also you get those dope ass lines from everybody, so it's all great. Don't hold back, let him have it, Silver. Hey, do you still have ring energy? Use the Wi Fi to switch with you. Okay, I think we could do some damage with Sonic. Yes, let's go. We're gonna do the rest with Sonic. So yeah, this is pretty fun. I actually do like this boss. Um, a lot of people have trouble saying, Oh, I love this! <laughs> he goes psycho with it. Oh, We're gonna see if we can find an opening. Alright, here. Man, did I not get damage on that? I'm having trouble multitasking and looking at the health bar and everything on the screen. The present day! Here and now that you've stolen, time to take it back. Ouch. Die. Are you okay? Use the white. So yeah, they're supposed to be fighting him in the past, present, and the future all at once. Which I think is pretty cool. But uh, you can clearly see him like where he was pointing at Sonic. I guess that's just like a game kind of thing. Oh no, I don't want to finish him with Shadow. Let's finish him with Sonic. This is the end. Yeah, but not with you, Silver. <laughs> yeah, see, we get that nice line from the lead. We're gonna make it, we're gonna make it, we're gonna make it, we're gonna make it. I say it right here. Who do you guys like to finish this uh, boss fight with? Because you can take it out with uh, Shadow or um, Silver. Let's see what I got. Nine minutes. That's a long ass time. I think I got the S. That was incredible. Thank you, Sonic. Thank you. Oof. I'm glad I finished it off with S's for uh, end of the world and for the final boss. I think that's a nice way to end it off. But yeah, I just really wanted to talk about the lore for Solaris because it's pretty interesting stuff. I, I'm thinking I'm actually gonna do a uh, a video talking about some certain lore things from this game that I thought were kind of cool playing through it. Cool. Oh, damn, we're just getting hella gold medals. You did all act missions in the last episode with that's right. Thanks. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> nice. Even Eggman is like, all right, I can go on another day. Yeah, uh, Amy's eyes was closed during the kiss. You guys didn't know that, by the way. Ooh, look at that shot. The stomach. <laughs> Ooh, maybe this will be the thumbnail. All good shots. I love it. It's all back to normal. Or it reverts back to the flame, rather, is what I mean. Did you destroy it? Nope. No. That is the true Solaris. So this is the true Solaris. It's just a freaking, yeah. 
super dimensional being, whatever Eggman called it. Look, Elise. Transcends time and space, you know? This is Solaris, the flame of hope. It's so beautiful. When the flame has grown large enough, our world will change. Solaris will allow us to control time and move through history. People will be able to rectify past mistakes and avoid bitter fate. Will we be able to see Mama? Yes, Elise. We'll both be able to see your mother once again. This is where everything began. Who knew such a tiny flame could bring such devastation? If we put out this flame, Solaris will never exist. And then we'll never have to worry about the flames of disaster, right? But our encounter... You and I will never meet. It will never have happened. I... To tell the truth... I don't care what happens to the world! Just I don't give a shit. <laughs> Blow that shit out now. I just got shot through the heart. It just happened all over again. <laughs> You're right. <laughs> no, I do really like this moment though. Sorry for spoiling it. Full circle here. I really do like the ending. And I think a lot of people liked the ending back when it came out. Despite everything, I think a lot of people agreed on liking the ending, which is funny. To me, at least. So was it Sonic Dead of the movie or what? Apparently Sonic, Shadow, and Mr. apparently Lee? even Silver, it felt they like remember someone like was calling something, me. which I think is consistent. Sure it's just the wind. Um, of course. In the lore and stuff. So Silver in the DS port of uh, probably he kind of like like remembers ways in a way. So like I feel like I've met you before. You know what I mean? Shadow, he probably remembers everything, he just never speaks on it. And then Sonic, yeah. Probably same on him too. But Silver's a newbie, so he doesn't get to keep all his memories. He's like, he didn't die, he's in Super Silver. <laughs> Shadow died. The first time he went Super. Anyways, I gotta shut up. That's a beautiful ending. I love the shot of the moon. Sonic's happy, everyone's happy, so it's all good. And now we are truly done with Sonic 06. Um, it's been a fun ride. 
I would say. Um, this is Elise's theme song, I believe. I don't remember the name of it. Um, it's all right. I actually used to like be so embarrassed uh, every time this song would play because I used to play the uh, last story a lot when I was a kid. I would always want to do the supersonic fight. I know you could probably go into the trial mode and do it there, but I would always go into the last story because I would like to see the cutscenes and everything. And yeah, I would always get so like embarrassed. I would start blushing hearing this song and I'd try to skip it. You probably can skip it, but uh, I don't know. I'm not going to try right now. <laughs> There's the infamous kiss. A lot of people hate it. I uh, specifically didn't like comment on it because it's just like, it's whatever. I can, I don't know. It's funny to me. That's all it is. It's just funny to me. She falls in love with the hedgehog. But I honestly still feel like it's consistent with her character. Like she doesn't do shit and then she gets out for the first time and she's doing all this shit with Sonic. So she's like, fuck it. And she lives in a world where animal people exist anyway. So she's like, I like this dude. And I think she's supposed to be like, um, probably like 16, 17. So, you know what I mean? Like she's like a young person. So it's not that, it's not the biggest deal to me. And it wasn't like a, it wasn't like super duper like, what the heck? I thought it was more weird that they were actually like trying to like, I don't know. Cause I, I in my opinion, I feel like Sonic actually does like, like her, but um, and that's just because that's who he is. Like he's a live in the moment kind of guy. Um, so he's also going on this adventure with her. He obviously sees that like, you know, she, she's feeling him and he's like, like yeah, I'm cool. You feel me? <laughs> I pick up bitches, you know? So I don't know. I'm not saying I always make jokes. Uh, I can't speak. I always make jokes about son lease, <laughs> but, uh, you know, I wouldn't say I like, I'm like a true, like actual fan of it, but I definitely understand like what the fuck they were going for. He doesn't even end up with her in the end. So it's not like the biggest deal. You know what I mean? It's almost like a forbidden love. Sonic wants to be with Elise so bad, but then she dies and then he saves her and then he dies and then she saves him. You know what I mean? And then they got to fucking rewrite reality. So it's all craziness. And then, yeah, I wonder if there was more dialogue options. I'll probably play around with it right now. And then if I could find like more cool dialogue that I wasn't able to pick up um, during our fight, even though we were doing that shit for almost 10 minutes. Um, I'll try to do like a separate video, like adding all the cool dialogue from the final boss fight. Cause I was talking over some of it, so yeah. Sorry, this uh, LP took me so long. Like I said, I'm like an adult now, <laughs> and I have a whole life and job and all that. So it's hard to sit down and uh, find time where my house is just completely quiet. You know what I mean? Just where I could do this, but uh, it's getting done. And I already got the next LP ready too. We're taking a break from Sonic. Uh, be on the lookout for that. And then also thank you to everybody that uh, does uh, sit down and watch these. If you actually make it to this point and you're hearing me say this, I do appreciate it. Uh, the the first part of the uh, last story got like a gang of views. I think it's over a thousand views already. So I'm very happy with that. I'm very happy with all my uh, episodes like the views on them so that's pretty cool it's nice to know that it, it, <laughs> my video is making the rounds out there so thank you guys i appreciate it if you can like the video um i said i was gonna do sonic one um when i come back to sonic but if you guys want to see something else let me know and i'll consider it you feel me um yeah i'm playing a short game next so that won't, the Sonic break won't be like a long one. Like we don't got to worry about it. And I'm planning on doing LPs um, a lot quicker than how long this one took me. So like I said, everybody who subbed, everybody who stuck around. Thanks again. I do appreciate it. Yeah, this song is good. I used to get so embarrassed, like I said, because I just thought it was girly, but it's actually a pretty decent song. I'm a little bit of a sucker for love songs as well. That's why I really like the uh, Sweet Dream song. And that plays at the end of Sonic Story.
Um, yeah, I have a bunch of like theories that I've been thinking about over the past few days doing all this. So I might make a few of those. I might make one video just talking about all my little Sonic 06 theories. Um, just cause I think it's fun. Like, you know what I mean? This was supposed to be a reboot. You feel me? For sure it was. It's like, come on now. It's supposed to be a reboot, but also it wasn't because it's like Rush is Sonic Rush was being considered <laughs> as far as Blaze was concerned. You know what I mean? Um, and some of Shadow's backstory, I guess, was supposed to be the same as well. But the point I'm just trying to get at is that like, there's just so much like uh, cool little stuff that is in here, like with the Solaris theories, Mephilus theories. Theories about silver. Theories about whether this game takes place in the main canon or in, in an alternate universe. Which they say now that it did happen. Like obviously, like if the timeline is one straight line, like this had to have happened in order for it to continue. And um, that's one of my theories. I feel like uh, Solaris, Mephilus, whoever you want to say, like they want, like it wanted this to happen because of like the Duke trying to experiment on it and all that, you know what I mean? It split it into two. So I feel like its ultimate goal was for it to, you know, rewrite the timeline. Cause it only, it only, uh, I don't know if what I'm about to say is stupid or not, but it's just like the events that gets changed is not like huge from this game. You know what I mean? Besides like the future getting destroyed, of course. Um, and I guess Eggman dying, but, uh, you know, all it wants is to stop that damn experiment from happening. And it does, but it all, does it kill itself? You know what I mean? Cause at least blows it out. Is it going to respawn one day? You know what I mean? So it's a lot of cool, it's a lot of cool stuff to think about. You know what I mean? A lot of people love Mephilus. A lot of people would love to see him come back. Um, so. I just feel like there's like a lot of good ideas here. I think the story is decent enough, um, even though like some things don't make sense in it. Um, the gameplay, like I said, I think it's also decent enough. It's just that Shadow Story is a little bit boring. Silver Story uh, is a little bit tedious and slow. Sonic Story is just flat all right, you know what I mean? But uh, other than that, like I, I, I kind of like this game. I'm do I sw I transitioned over to my wrap up thoughts because now it's over, but uh, you know I guess I'll just talk on the on the screen. I'll probably try to yeah we'll save here. Okay, so yeah now we got a hundred percent on everything. Like I said, one day I'll come back with the metal video and the um, side mission video. We'll just sit here on the extras menu for the end of this. Thanks everybody for watching. Like I said, I'm basically just reiterating everything I just said. Thanks again for watching. I think the game's pretty much all right. I really like the level design of this game. I think the story is all right enough, especially like the ending. Like I always love the ending of this game. Um, so yeah, Sonic Story's really fun in my opinion. Um, Shadow story is just, you know, blah. It gets kind of cool towards the end. And then the story in Shadow is great. And then I like Silver Story as well, story-wise. And then the gameplay can be fun. I'm a fan of the mech shooting levels in SA2. So, you know what I mean? The bar is low for me. But other than that, thanks, guys, for watching. I do appreciate it. Um, next game I'm going to be playing is going to be LEGO Star Wars uh, 1 the original trilogy or no i'm sorry what the fuck is that game called lego star wars the video game my bad yeah so just stay tuned for that thanks guys bye